So just as before, when we were learning octaves, we were learning to uh, tune a lower octave and a higher octave. Um, and even as you go up into positions, you can continue practicing octaves. The, what is basically changing, again, is that your hand is just shifting upwards. So you'll find that your first and fourth finger the, in the octave position, they're going to be the same, except that your whole hand is just shifted up a whole step. So for the first one, we're going to learn a B octave. So to get to the B, slide up to the B from the G string. You might have to adjust your fourth finger just a little bit, and depending on how big your hand is, if you have somewhat of a smaller hand, again, you might have to find that you have to bring your arm around just slightly to help you reach the fourth finger. But if you have more longer arms like I do, um, you, it won't be necessary for you to really bring your arm around like that. Um, if you have kind of a smaller hand, it's good to practice reaching your fourth finger as well.